Intravital microscopy of the cremasteric microcirculation is a convenient method to gain insights into ischemia reperfusion injury of striated muscle tissue. In a step-by-step -step protocol, we depict how to get started with respiration-controlled anesthesia under sufficient monitoring via arterial cannulation to keep the animal firmly anesthetized for longer periods of time. We illustrate how to cannulate the jugular vein and then describe the cremastric preparation as a thin flat sheet for outstanding optical resolution. We provide a protocol for leukocyte imaging in ischemia reperfusion injury that has been well established in our laboratories. This model can be used to analyze leukocyte activation for ischemia reperfusion injury research. Ischemia reperfusion injury has been implicated in a large area of pathological conditions such as myocardial infarction, intestinal ischemia, as well as following transplant and cardiovascular surgery. Reperfusion of previously ischemic tissue, while essential for the prevention of irreversible tissue injury, elicits excessive inflammation of the affected tissue. Adjacent to the production of reactive oxygen species, the activation of the complement system, and increased microvascular permeability, the activation of leukocytes is one of the principal actors in the pathological cascade of inflammatory tissue damage during reperfusion. We here promote intravital microscopy of the postcapillary venule as a convenient method to analyze leukocyte activation in ischemia reperfusion injury. We further illustrate common pitfalls and provide useful tips which should